Hey guys, what's up? It's Christian and Corey, and this is our review of Naruto 605, the most bloody, epic, berserk-like chapter yet. Ugh! So in this chapter, Obito loses his shit, and Ren is definitely fucking dead. So after Ren's pretty much pronounced dead on the scene, uh, the Miss Ninja immediately are like, oh crap, like, we were just about to get our hands on her, and the enemy took her out. And that's not exactly how they said it, but it's implied that she may be on their side. Maybe she was a spy or something. You know, we'll leave uh, that discussion for the end of the video, but definitely something interesting. And next, Obito and Kakashi unlock their Mangekyo Sharingan. Obviously, they're both Obito's eyes, but Kakashi being pretty low on chakra and, you know, he looks battle damaged and everything, he just passes out, and Obito goes on the attack, and this is like the beginning, if you want to say, of his mental breakdown as he, like, screams up to the sky with his hands up, I do not believe this! It's pretty badass. So Obito is just fueled by the rage of seeing Rin killed and activating his Mangekyo Sharingan. And you can see he's starting to go through this rapid transformation. He has all these tree branches exploding out of his body. One thing that's interesting to notice, some of them are actually black. Maybe this is a hint towards a black Setsu. Have no idea. All I know is everything that's about to happen is completely metal and fucking awesome. All this really great action. We have this big ass Miss Ninja who's getting ready to uh, attack Obito and he's jumping right towards him. He's like, how dare you take on the bloody Miss? <laughs> and fucking Obito just gets right up on him and he punches him. And what's great about this one panel is you can see the difference in the size of these characters. This one Miss Ninja is friggin' huge. Obito's just this little guy. And what he does is when he punches him, he activates his Mokutan abilities and he has all of these branches pierced and explode out of this guy with this blood going all over the place as if that's not enough one of those branches is going through that guy and then into another guy just fucking him up completely double penetration crazy <laughs> some of the other Miss Ninja try to attack him they're coming up from the top and they're getting ready to stab him Obito's getting ready to kill this other ninja that's right below him and this is when we get to see that since he has his brand new Mangekyo and everything he has his space time jutsu and they try to stab him but it goes right through him and they stab the other Miss Ninja Hold <laughs> balls! After that, Obito does this like triple kick where he takes all those guys out at once, and then he starts running through all these other Miss Ninja, and he does this other really cool technique where he shoots this tree branch at one of them, and then he does the uh, the ninjutsu move, and then he like has these tree branches just explode in this guy's body, and he's not done yet. He decides to knee this guy in the face right <laughs> after that, and guess what? He's not done yet. He grabs his head and actually has a branch just if, you know, explode right through this guy's forehead. They don't really show it, but it's definitely implied here. And the Miss Ninja are freaking out. They don't know what to do. All they know is they have to get Rin's corpse. Why? We have no idea. All we know is this is just making Obito, or really Zetsu, more pissed off. Actually, during all of this, it's really Zetsu who's doing all the fighting, and Obito sort of is, like, blacking out. He can't really tell what's going on. Yeah, it definitely seems like Zetsu is in control. And I have to say the last panel of this chapter was by far, you know, what really brought it home. And me and Corey have discussed it. That's probably going to be the thumbnail because it's just so epic. You see all these branches come up. They look like the Obito mask around the moon. Obviously, this is uh, some foreshadowing to the Moon Eye plan. And uh, it looks like something Kentoro Miura made, uh, the author of Berserk. It was just ridiculous. Uh, all the dead uh, bloody Miss Ninja and all the tree branches as they spiral up towards the moon. There's blood everywhere. And Obito is sitting there and he's He's like, where am I? And as uh, the Zetsu pulls away and he has this bloody eye socket, he's like, oh, yeah, hell. And it's so like, oh, my God. He doesn't even like sound very upset. He's just like, oh, yeah, I'm in hell. He's been deadened by this whole thing. Like yeah. numbed. Like this is the immediate mental breakdown, you know, for sure moment where Obito. This is the chapter that people will remember where Obito became evil. Okay, so what did Super Kami Guru 9000 think of Naruto 605? My favorite part is when Ren died. Okay, <laughs> let's get serious here for a second. Uh, honestly, it was cool to see, first of all, how Obito and Kakashi got their MS. That was a big thing we were talking about before the review. Huge deal. Huge deal. Uh, everyone's been speculating. We never saw Kakashi's MS until after the time skip, so it was assumed that within that, what was that, a two or, no, I'm thinking one piece, two-year time skip is like a five-year time skip. Mm. Whatever Even it was. Longer. Even longer. It was, uh, it was assumed that that's when Kakashi unlocked it, uh, but obviously that didn't really make sense because Kakashi probably didn't have anyone die in that time. Uh, so it does make sense that it happened during the Rin death. Uh, the whole Rin may being maybe a spy. That's kind of something that's coming up after this chapter. Obviously, Kakashi killed her for a reason. 
I don't think he accidentally shanked her, and then they were like, oh, wait, she was important. They just, I don't know. I mean, it is the hidden mist, you know? That's I mean, true. It's kind of hard to see in that mist. And Kakashi knew about that move uh, when he was fighting uh, Zabuza, so it's mm -hmm. obvious that uh, he's had some experience with this mm -hmm. uh, technique before. I think the Ren stuff is interesting uh, in the sense that, like, she may be a bad person, and I will continue to say this. I'm not sure how much I've said this in the videos before, but uh, I think Rin... Uh, will be revealed as a bad guy, maybe, and Obito will become a good guy again at the very end, and they'll all fight Madara together, and they'll all hug, you know, and have an orgy or something. Good guy orgy. Well, I'll respect your opinion on the fact that, yeah, you know, maybe Rin is out. a bad guy, but I don't think she is. Uh, but l let me just talk about this. Uh, this is an action manga. So if you guys have anything negative to say about this chapter, which was just raw, brutal-ass action... You can get out. What? You can <laughs> get out! Because this was just an incredible chapter full of the most awesome, fluid, brutal action I've ever seen from uh, Toby Zetsu Obito Madara. Whatever the what fuck he is. Every time. But uh, he has so many different characters at this point. But uh, just... I was reading this last night, and, uh, you know, he was saying that it was like, Kentaro Miura must have been drawing this. That's not far off. There was so much blood in this chapter. This, to me, was probably one of the most bloody chapters I've actually seen of the chat, uh, of the entire series. And no, blood does not make a good chapter. But it really emphasizes how brutally insane Zetsu is at this point, and how he's sort of taking over Obito's body, and how he's just sort of blacking out, and just... Every little piece of action was just drawn in such a really, really great way. All the action was fluid. I, my only problem with the chapter is when they get to the anime, I wonder how much of this they're actually going to censor because this was just damn brutal as shit, and I don't know if they're going to show that much blood and, you know, freaking people it was like exploding. showering off of him. It was like... Yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> it's not like there was just blood on the ninja. Yeah, there was blood all over his mask just dripping down and everything. I mean, this was the most brutal chapter of Naruto I think I've ever read, and... Uh, I think just Toby's an even more awesome villain just from watching it now. He's just so threatening after seeing this. We've never seen Mokotan used like this before. You know, we've seen uh, Yamato use his, big like... ass roots and shit. It's never, like, you exactly. know, stab you and then explode out of your body and stuff like that. It just, you know, like, and, traps you. And that last panel, again, with, uh, you know, going up into the moon and everything, that looked really, really cool. Uh, just a really great-looking panel. All the ninja embedded in, like, all the roots and everything, and they're bloody, and it's all fucked up. It's all metal as shit. It's just crazy. <laughs> this in Bleach this week? Holy balls! I cannot say that enough. Holy balls. So there's our official report on uh, Naruto uh, <laughs> 605. Uh, Holy if, balls. It's not obvious what the score is, huh, guys? Mm, we're going to we'll mm. probably give it a 3 out of 10. Mm. Mm. No, 10 out of 10 it is, guys. Absolutely awesome chapter. Uh, me and Corey are obviously action junkies, so, you know, we love this stuff. And uh, set up a lot of good questions, which mm. are going to get answered hopefully soon. Yeah. Mangekyo uh, Sharingan stuff was important. Uh, learning that the Hidden Mist were always called the Bloody Mist. And, of course, just getting to see uh, all this happen for the very first time is important. The only thing we need to know now is what's up with Rin. And the other thing is, you guys heard us mention uh, a manga series called Berserk a lot in this review. If you do not know what that's about and you are okay with mature manga, we highly recommend that you go check that out and read it. It's very good. There's also an original 25 episode anime series, right? 25 episodes. Mm -hmm. And uh, they're re releasing the first uh, 25 episodes in three movies right now. And the first movie is out or about to come out. So check that stuff out too if you want to. Also, uh, that is it this week, actually, guys. Yeah. So until next time, Super Kami Guru. Actually, wait, if you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, bitches. It helps a lot. Thank you. Okay, until next time, Super Kami Guru 9000 out.